Hello everybody, what is going on? It is Corey here and today I'm going to teach you guys how to install the Aether mod. It just came out today and um, so I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install it. Uh, and this is going to be uh, with a fresh dot .minecraft, so save your worlds, uh, delete your dot .minecraft folder. And if you do not know how to do that, you just uh, go here. Actually just press the Windows key and then press R. Type percent app data percent. And uh, if you know how to do this, I'm sorry, but uh, this is from a noob standpoint. Uh, if you've installed mods, just delete the whole .minecraft, but if you haven't, then uh, it's cool. So you're going to need 7-zip to open archive and stuff like that, so I'm going to right-click on Minecraft right here, minecraft.jar. going to go to 7-zip, open archive. going to minimize this. Then uh, right away, just delete your meta-in folder because that will collide with the mod. And um, <coughs> there's a few mods that you're going to need ahead of time to do this, so let's go into my 1.703 right here. and. Um, First off, uh, let's do mod loader. So, uh, go ahead and you're gonna need mod loader, audio mod, Shaka API, and obviously the Aether mod. I'm just gonna have too many items because I always use that. So, I'm gonna install that as well. Let me actually do that first. So, open archive, and then you just uh, drag everything into your Minecraft.jar. Click on yes, and you're good. So, um, okay, so. Uh, the download links will be in the description, all of them, so you can go check that out there. And uh, so now I'm going to go ahead and go to Mod Loader. And, uh, I'm going to Control Control A, drag those into here, click on Yes, go back, Audio Mod, same thing, drag it into there, click Yes. Then I'm going to install Shock API, and here you have to open this bin right here. Then you select everything, then drag that into there click on yes and um, now for the Aether mod itself you can go into the jar take everything in here actually let me control A to make sure I don't miss anything drag that into there yes I'm gonna go back resources actually I'm gonna take resources go back here in this part go to your bin folder see where it says resources just drag this resources folder into here and um, after that it should be good it's as simple as that then you go ahead and open up your minecraft log in and uh... hope and pray that you don't get a black screen create a new world pro tip the best time to do anything is before it's too late so it looks like it's installed right uh... because uh... i'm getting this uh... message here just making sure i'm actually recording that would suck if i'm not recording right would suck Okay, um, why is it not loading? Okay, there you go. It's building terrain. It's building terrain. It's slowly but surely building terrain. Just give it a second. Just give it a second. Uh, your computer's performance is slow. Thanks for telling me. I can see that for some reason. It's, I should have had a world made already. I'm stupid. But, um, okay. Saving chunks. Okay, we're in. So press E for inventory, and I uh, got all this stuff. So you can tell it's installed. But uh, to go to the actual Aether, gonna actually I need some. Where's the glowstone at in this stuff? Well, you see all the items here basically that I can just spawn because I have too many items on. But I won't be cheating with that. I need to find where is it? Oh, here it is, glowstone. I need a bucket of water, and um, then uh, you just go get some stone actually go into the water because whenever you die in the aether you are uh, whenever you die in the aether you just fall out of the sky in your actual world so yeah that's not good um, okay so we're just gonna make a nice platform here actually we won't need that piece there but whatever okay shit keep pressing E because I usually use the fly mod so E for inventory. Okay, but it is installed, so you just, if you want to click out of the video, you can now. But um, if you like this tutorial, short, simple, straight to the point, please give it a like, and uh, I will be doing a lot of videos, daily videos on this, uh, daily videos on AdventureCraft, and uh, one Call of Duty video. So I do three videos a day, and uh, so yeah, you can stay tuned for that awesome commentary. Okay, um, did I make it too high? Three. Three. Four have no idea. Anyways, uh, if you go like this, should make a portal to the Aether, step in here, and be dazzled. Entering the Aether, building terrain, so this might take another year, but um, 
you guys get the gist, it works, and uh, that is how you install the Aether mod. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, just check out the Aether real quick, and, uh, and then we can head on our way back to uh, do whatever we're doing. I know you guys, most of you probably already clicked out of the video, and if you haven't, then good for you. You're awesome. Any day now. Okay, awesome. So, shit, this this is not a good place to be. It's still loading. Okay. We're in the Aether, though. Okay, it's loading the ground below me, but uh, we're in the Aether, so it doesn't work. And I just want to say once again, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, like I said, leave a, a comment below if, uh, if you uh, found this helpful or any problems you may have. And um, yeah, don't forget to thumbs up the video and uh, subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all later. Peace out.